Hello everyone and welcome to this video. Today we're going to be getting Skyrim working in virtual reality using the Vorpex driver. This one was actually very easy to get set up. I was pretty surprised at how quick I was able to get it working. So let's swap over to the desktop now and I'll show you how to get things set up. Okay, so the first thing we need to do is actually start our Oculus app. So I'm going to do that now. Then start Vorpex. Right click Vorpex and configure. Click Game Settings Optimizer in the left side panel and type in Skyrim. Depending on which version you have, I have the special edition version, select it and choose optimize settings. Now click apply and close. Now we're ready to launch it and give it a try. I'll just grab my headset. So I think the reason that this is so easy to get going is it supports the direct VR which is a function in Vorpex to configure the games automatically so and we're in guys it's probably a good idea to play the game on your screen first and save it and then load it up in virtual reality just to get past all that annoying stuff at the beginning now I'm going to show you is the Vorpex in-game menu which is where we can further tweak the game to make things look even better once you are in game, press the delete key on your keyboard. Navigate to the direct VR, it should be on the main menu, here it is. Direct VR scan, press this button and let go of your mouse. Okay, now that says field of view fail on screen, however it has changed the field of view. So I'm guessing that must be a, a small bug in the Vorpex driver because the trees aren't bending over my head now, they're straight, everything's perfectly appropriate to what it should be, to, you know, to my body. So I'm going to go into the delete menu again, and for my 3D settings, all of them work, however I found the best one I'm used is Z normal, not adaptive, Z normal. I haven't changed anything else in here, everything is just on default. If you want, you can sharpen it up a bit, change the scale of the hood, things like that. And that's it guys, that's really that simple. Yeah, there's nothing else in here that I need to mess around with. I'm actually going to turn off the mirroring now. There we go. I just had that on so you guys could see the Vorpex in-game menu. Beautiful game in VR. Beautiful. Thanks for checking out this video guys. I hope it's helped you out getting the game working. Be sure to subscribe because I'm working my way for a huge list of games for this program and there's some really great stuff coming up. Peace out guys.